Hello from Slovenia again. <clears throat> I will do another kind of rainbow reverse flower dip. Last time I did it with um, uh, this uh, bottle bottom, but today I will use my flower shaped cups. And for pearl white, I mixed my Vallejo pearl medium with white acrylic ink today. I tried yesterday in uh, my life and uh, it worked fine but I did just black and white so let's see how this will go. So I started with dioxys in purple and indigo Uh, and this is brilliant blue and as you probably know if you watch my videos more this part takes some time so if you don't want to watch, you know what to do. And this green. <coughs> and pearl white, because you can't rush this process. You just have to pour your paints. Um, kind of slowly and cadmium yellow, lemon hue and white again as you can see I don't add as much white as other colors just a little to get some lacing so otherwise it will take over and orange, vermilion <clears throat> I will put all the colors and brands into the description box so you don't have to listen this if you don't want to you will know anyway and cadmium red and I will add another layer Violet again. Ooh. And pearl. And indigo. And pearl. And brilliant blue. And pearl. Uh, we have kind of um, my daughter-in-law is pregnant and she had some alarm today but it's everything okay it's still early to have a baby but I'm glad that everything is okay but we all were a little concerned what will happen but now it's everything okay and I hope it will be still everything okay until it will be time to 
my second granddaughter come to this world. And I hope <clears throat> that this world will be better like it is these days with all weird things happening all over the world. Maybe that's why it's nice to do some bright colors like rainbow colors to brighten up this world a little bit and I will drag this out like I normally do some of you ask me why but it's just what I love to do to get some nice patterns and I will do one when I will pour this um, rack or whatever I will do this pattern a little different in my next video but you will have to wait so I will add just one layer here so it will be faster than the outs other the outer one indigo and pearl white again and brilliant blue pearl white again I will not talk about this anymore uh, so I was packing today to because I have to send out some giveaways for from my patreon site and uh, from my yesterday's giveaway so thank you all for coming and participating and at my giveaway I hope that you will like your prizes whoop almost throw my stick into this this would not be okay vermilion and red and we are done with layering and I think that I have a lot of paint here because it's almost flow of the edge on this side so obviously I wasn't put my cup totally in the middle or maybe my canvas is not totally leveled all two things are both is possible okay dokey so let's and I didn't put my phone off just a second okay sorry guys I forgot to mute my phone I checked if it's my son I would answer but other things can can wait Somebody is pretty much persistent. I hope that it will be okay now. I will spray my paper napkin.
just a second. I will do this. Okay. <laughs> no interruptions anymore. So maybe some of you will say, why didn't you edit your video and cut this out? I could have, but I have a life, so sometimes my phone rings if I forgot, forget to mute it and sometimes my dogs barking and but I'm a real person I'm not uh, uh, a computer person I'm not a robot so and I live real life like all of you so maybe it's just okay that sometimes you hear something from my life too not just me talking let's see what will happen just hoping that I will lift up my napkin okay today because sometimes I don't and I ruin quite a lot of pattern if I don't do it nice so I really want this rainbow to be a beautiful rainbow for brighten up our days and it is wow I really really like it I just see that I will so uh, somebody asked me what to do if uh, you have this um, edge here you just pour some paint around it will spread a little bit and level out so that then you will not have this big edge if you have this edge on the outside of the flower just cover it with paint and try to spread it a little bit but you know that it will level out itself too but it doesn't level out if you have this big bridge between so here is quite okay just a little bit on the edge What do you say about this one? I will torch it a little bit. I could have uh, done a little better job with lifting my napkin, I think. I'm tempted to to spin it just a little bit not too much just a little bit and I will pour just a little of black more black here because I want this part to spread a little bit so I will put it on my spinner and 
and try to spin it just lightly, not too much. Just to go a little over the edge, maybe here. So I will just add a little more black. Okay. And I think that I will leave it now. Or should I spin a little bit more? Because some nice patterns coming through. Okay, and this will be it. We'll just try to just a little of this blue because it just. I don't know, too blue. Okay. And let's torch it. And as you can see, uh, it's not so much white, it's more lacing um, effect with this um, ink mixture. So let me take you down. Oops, sorry guys. And my I miss a little of yellow because green and yellow maybe mix a little too much. And my purple looks um, blue, but it's not blue. So you see, it's a lot of nice lacing. But I'm thinking next time that I will do just one layer on the outside too. One layer on the outside and one on the inside. That Maybe I will keep more of the colors and uh, maybe I will add a little different shade of green instead of this one. So, But I'm happy with it. It's a happy flower and I hope that it brings some happiness to your world too. I sure want to send that so this is it for today and see you on the next one bye